Hi, I am Beth Lawrence. I'm a language and literacy expert, and I'm CEO and co-founder of Infocabulary. We have a web-based K-12 instruction tool that deeply teaches vocabulary and improves critical thinking. We have an enormous problem in this country, illiteracy, and there is a steady pipeline coming straight out of K-12 schools. That's our target market. Meet Panina. She was an eighth grade student of mine. I was teaching her the meanings of words, but I was using language to do it. And she had the primary deficit in the language domain. She was the muse for a brand new approach in vocabulary instruction. Why not ask students to visually, critically think themselves to a deep understanding of vocabulary? Check out this screenshot from one of our games. Find the common thread among the four pictures, and then which one word goes with all four? You just engaged in visual semantic reasoning. In vocabulary works, we have published peer-reviewed journal uh, research that showed that students scored far higher the weeks that they learned within vocabulary, and one school statistically significantly increased their scores on annual assessments. Our business model, we're a SaaS business, and it's based on $9 per student per calendar year. We have experienced year over year 100% growth for the last three years, and now we've hired a VP of sales, and we're seeing even higher growth. We also have some pretty amazing testimonials. The ed tech market is huge. Check out these local acquisitions, including Workbench that was acquired by Google. Well, that's just one of our many advisors. We are focused on the $3 billion vocabulary instruction market. And note, one of our competitors was just recently acquired. We get that K-12 sales are complex. We have a sophisticated strategy, and we also can tap into funding resources that our competitors can't because our tool makes so much sense for students who come from um, in Title I and uh, special education. Our team is awesome. Check out our uh, advisors and mentors and investors. Uh, and my name is Beth Lawrence. Please reach out to me with any questions. Thank you.